week. All right, welcome back to BYU Sports Nation. We now welcome to the program for the first time ever a set of twins. They are Daviana and Leveni Vaca of the women's soccer team. Welcome to the program. Great to have you. Thanks for having us. Yeah, and thanks for sweet. setting the, uh, the new record here for twins on the show. Okay, so <laughs> Daviana... Yeah. Laveni. Daviana, though. Daviana. Yeah. Thank you. Okay. <laughs> Minor detail for the people who call the games. Why didn't you tell me that? My bad. Okay. Let, let's talk about uh, this season. How's fall camp going right now? Let's start, start uh, with It's you. great. It's, um, it's intense, but we're super excited. We have our first game this weekend, so we're all getting ready for that. And, yeah, everyone's been showing up. A lot of competition has been happening. Yeah, we're competing every day. It's been super exhausting. Like, the other day, we are practicing in the second session. Jen's, like, telling our trainer, Carolyn, she's like, it was so bad. Like, they must be exhausted because they could, the second drill just wasn't good. But we're, you know, that's expected for us to be exhausted if we're competing every day. But Well, Ruby uh, Laddick said uh, she ran 40 miles last week or that something. Was yeah. Like, for the blue and white scrimmage, huh? And that was before the scrimmage. Yeah, mm -hmm. so we probably yes. did more than that. So you guys are putting in how many miles a day? Five, Shoot. seven. Oh, definitely. Yeah, eight. seven, nine, yeah. nine a day. You guys <laughs> track all that stuff, right? Yeah, yeah, we always try and track to see yeah. how much we do. You're basically on the cross country team, but you also <laughs> have a soccer ball. <laughs> oh, yeah, like, that's great. a lot of running. Just run with a soccer ball. Yeah. yeah. Oh my gosh. So, okay, after last year and all the success that we saw last year, how do you take last year's experience into a new season? Because I know everybody wants, you know, last year's last year. We want to focus on this year, but I, I've got to imagine the experience that you guys took can really help you out this season. How do you do that? Um, so personally, like taking my experience, that was my like, you know, first breakout year, I guess you could say. Um, taking that experience and just carrying it over to the team, like especially helping with the back line and our new center back that's filling in the role for Grace Johnson. Just helping our back line out, just stay connected, helping the new incomers, like the freshmen, bringing them in. They're here in spring, and so it's nice that they were here in spring and just carry them over into fall. And just try and find a new identity besides last year's team. So we're constantly getting compared, and mm -hmm. that's our mission right now, is just finding our identity and our, being ourselves. Which is probably interesting because last year is the greatest team in BYU women's soccer history, yet yeah. your career's not over. Like if you're yeah. Kayla or Cam or Cassidy, you're like, yep, we were the greatest, we're done, we're yeah. out, right? <laughs> but you guys are still here. You have a legacy to continue, and you have the pressure of now you're ranked third. Hey, when you go 9-0-1-1 in spring, mm -hmm. people still think you're really good. So what's it like right now, uh, Daviana, Daviana, to uh, sort of be this new group and carve out your own identity, like you said? Um, like she said, we're really trying to find our identity and the new freshman class as well as me. Like, we all have new roles. I'm still trying to figure that out. Because you were a forward, you might be a <laughs> center back? Yeah, so I'm like, yeah, I was a forward. I am a defender now. I'm going back between center back and outside back. Um, the back line's still the same, so the experience is still there, and as well as the forwards, like we have Rachel McCarthy, Bella Felino, like all that experience is still there, just without Kayla and Cam. So we're all figuring that out, but we're going to do really good, I think, this year. How do you feel about the potential position switch? Because personally, oh, I'd I love, love it. to see you back <laughs> no, there yeah, together. I love it. Like, Lava and I are really aggressive on the team, and I think um, I just like winning the ball more than scoring goals. That's my new thing now, but... Mm. Yeah. It, it would be super fun to have us playing together. Like in the blue and white game, it was nice to just communicate to each other. But at the same time, I'm like getting frustrated with her. I'm like yelling at her. That, so like, <laughs> like one of my goals like after like the game was like, like just positive communication <laughs> to my sister. Cause I'm like, you know, cause she's my sister. So I can yell at her, like yeah. be negative. But uh, I, I was going to say, what, yeah, how's that relationship? Yeah, let's, what's, let's get into that because sister's one thing. Twins, it's another level. What, oh, yeah. what's, the, what's the best part about having your sister on the team and, and the worst part? Oh, I feel like competing, just competing with each other, and then the worst would probably be just being able to be brutally honest. I know it's like super uncomfortable for our teammates. Yeah, to watch. Like, oh yeah, or like I'll be like for no, your you teammates. Are, yeah. Are like, you guys comfortable for them to watch? Oh yeah, oh, we're comfortable. We're comfortable yeah. You've been doing that your whole life. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I'll take I'll take like feedback from anyone else but her. Like it just <laughs> makes me so mad, and then I just can't respond well to her. So, but yeah. yeah. And, who's, and like who's the oldest? Me. Okay. Yeah. By how many minutes? <laughs> like two minutes. Two minutes. Okay. Yeah. yeah. It's a big two minutes, though, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, actually, so we didn't even know who was the oldest until senior year when we graduated. So yeah. my mom kept it Are a secret. Are you serious? Yeah. Really? Yeah. Oh so my all gosh. my family kept it a secret. Like, who was the oldest? She always used to say, like, they just took us out at the same time. Both exactly. Like, she had a C section <laughs> yeah. and they lifted us up. And of course, we fell for it for. 18 what? years. Yeah, yeah, 18 years. And then they did a reveal at our graduation party on who was the oldest. And so I always knew it was me. So it, yeah, I, I think a lot me. of people knew that. What was, what was that like for you, being 
Uh, I, is that disappointing? I mean, no. I, I kind of knew I was the youngest because I was kind of more spoiled than her growing yeah. up. <laughs> my siblings always babied her. Yeah. So. Are you more of the leader type organizer? Yeah, more yeah. independent, yeah. That's, funny. <laughs> That's hilarious. Okay, we're talking to you, uh, Daviana and Leveni Vaca. Uh, and you guys, you guys have nicknames, too. Yep. Lava. Lava. Davi. And yep. Davi. Yep. But Davi. not Davy. No, not Davy, because Davy sounds weird. Because it's like Davy Crocker <laughs> yeah. or something. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay. So you, you played the blue and white game. Uh, 2 0 win for the white team. Mm -hmm. uh, you got an alumni game. You got North Carolina. What's this week and a half like as you guys get ready for the season? Um, right now, it's just trying to figure out and figure out the rhythm right now, figuring out who's there, who's in. Center back, I guess, is kind of open right now and just getting the other center back spot. Yeah, yeah, the other not center yours. back. Not yours. Yeah. I hope not mine. <laughs> You're like, I've, I'm a returning starter. Like, we good? I don't think you have to worry about that. No. <laughs> um, but yeah, so we're just prepping. We are just learning how to build out of the back, just um, playing two touch, speed, tempo, and just going to goal. We need to get more shots, shots on frame, and so that's what we're working on towards North Carolina. So you guys had an opportunity, we want to make sure we talk about this, a really cool experience of playing with the Tonga national team so in, in the Nations follow. Cup in Fiji last month. What was that experience like and to be able to experience it together? Yeah, it was super exciting. Um, we played against some really good teams. Uh, the soccer, we'll just say out there, is <laughs> super intense, aggressive. Like it's crazy how aggressive they are overseas and here in the States. But it was a really cool experience. Um, we played with them in 2018. 18. Yeah, we were seniors in high school. So yeah. On the senior national team? Yeah. yeah. Wow. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I was able to score my first international at that time, and then you scored yours this past month. Yeah. Okay. And did you assist on that? Yeah. Yes, you did. That. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So that was pretty cool. That's awesome. Yeah, yeah it was a great experience. Um, like she said, they, their like, style is just being aggressive, playing super direct. You know, here we play like possession. keep possession and so that's kind of what we brought to the team and um, just more experience from I guess overseas they like to call us overseas players which is kind of special but shout out to Juan Diego as well which yeah. is yeah. not overseas yeah. <laughs> it's in Salt Lake but yeah. yeah that's pretty cool well best of luck with everything tonight in the alumni game again if you want to go uh, you know free admission not not broadcast you got to show up but then at North Carolina on Saturday, you yeah. can listen to that. It's going to be best, awesome. Best yeah. of luck. Let's give you the BYU Sports Nation karma. You get good luck. Yeah. I want to see you at center back, <laughs> selfishly. So best of luck in that competition. Thank you. Yeah, thank, thank you, guys. All right.